Hey guys, it's Raspberry Jam Gaming here, and today we've got another Wind Waker episode. So, just a quick disclaimer: um, you're probably wondering why I'm here and all that stuff. Where's the boss fight? Um, uh, uh, some stupid stuff I've done. Um, I didn't film all this stuff, so if you see that I have all these upgrades and all that stuff, I apologize. Uh, my footage got corrupted and stuff. Um, I'll try my hardest to find the, um, the footage. Uh, if I could, I would. But I, I can't, because the footage got corrupted and I didn't have enough storage and all that stuff. Uh, yeah, it's all my fault, so um, I'm sorry if I did that by any chance, guys. But you didn't really miss, miss much. You just missed a Ganon fight and all that stuff. You, you actually missed a lot, really. Um, but if I find the, um... The footage, I'll, I'll just submit it on my other channel, um, Jammy, where I just post all my other content that um, that's got corrupted or anything. Just content that I generally missed messed up on. All right, let's get right into it. Oh, I don't, oh, I don't know what we're doing. We're just I think collecting pieces of heart. If not, well, I've already cut it as much as we possibly can. I'm just going to get my phone out so I can do some research. So, I, I, I really do apologize, guys, for not uploading that content to you, to my channel. So, I mean, was anyone really going to watch that, honestly? I mean, it does bother me because it's not showing my proper completion through the playthrough. But, ugh, I'll try to find it and I'll edit it out if I find it. We'll change the date. This lady's gonna do something very naughty. What are you gonna steal? I think you have to follow her, so. Go over here. Then she'll be like, Oh, no one's there. I'm gonna keep running. Run, child, run. Then she'll have like. <laughs> I sure hope not a magical fairy boy is following me. I'm just blending in the grass. Keep moving. I like to move it, move it. Oh, she's really sus. Sussy bucker. <laughs> you stole me. What, what do you want? M -m My heart is racing. <laughs> you scared me. Wait, are you? The kind of creep who goes around at night scaring people? That's just a pain, plain mean. Just what do you think you are, anyway? An ally of justice. An ally of justice. <laughs> Whoa, an ally of justice. Justice in American way. Uh, I'm not a thief, I swear. I haven't stolen anything. Well, yet. Please, let me go. It was just an impulse. That's all just a bad idea. Why don't, why don't you say anything? Does this mean you're not mad at me? You're mad at me? 
Could you at least listen to the circumstances in my life that led me up to this moment, please? You owe me that much. Quite, you. I was... I was once the richest little... Demiant? Debunt? Demunt in this town. Did you know that? But one day, a monstrous bird came and took me away to a terrible place called the Forsaken Fortress, where I was locked up and held captive. Oh, it was awful. My father spent every last ruby in his coffers in an attempt to get me rescued. And that's right, every last bit of our family fortune gone. That was when my life... When my life was... That one, that was, that was when my life turned to poverty began. Now every day from morning until night, I'm busy working for the open air shop. So you, as you can see, at least I'm trying to settle into my poor lifestyle. Doesn't that just tug your hair strings? What do you say about tragic events in my pitiful life? And to make matters worse, for some reason, I still can't figure out that s slob Maggie, who who was the poorest girl in town, suddenly gone got filthy rich. Maggie of all people. It makes me so mad that I want want to do something terrible. <laughs> do you understand? Thank you so much. Got a jar! Let's go the last one! That's all the jars collected. Yeah, in the last episode I got a jar. I, I, no, I think I bought it. No, I think it was actually good footage. I don't know. It was only seven minutes of footage when I got the jar. I don't know. I think it was at the beginning of it. It must have been. <laughs> and uh, you, you know that this person's rich by the door they have. You, halt! Oh, you're just one of the wretched street, you I thought you were the, po the postman. Be thankful, because if you were the postman, aye, 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 I would have sold you out for here before you could say, Ooh. But say, you look uh, you look rather familiar for a uh, street urchin. Yorchin? Yorchin, Yorchin. Have we perhaps met before, someplace? Oh, you're the idiot! Mmm! You're the poop man. Oh, to think that I was... I would survive my horror and return to this town. And to think that I would never be able to live in such a beautiful opulent house. It's like a dream come true. Mm, but no, no, it's a nightmare without him by my side. It's like a rainstorm rages in my heart. He was so kind to me in the Forsaken Fortress. That sweet boy who gave me all those expensive necklaces who I fed from the cursed island. Just hearing the name lifts my spirits of Mo, the wonderful Moblin from the Forsaken Fortress. I'm always writing in my heartfelt letters to fill within my overwhelming emotions, but why don't you answer me, Mo? No, I won't read it. I have no interest in love and all that weird stuff. Can I? 
I hate this guy. I, I really do hate him. He just sounds like a douche among men. Generally, when I grow up, I want to be rich, but I don't want to be like that arrogant idiot that's just like, Look at me, I got money. Oh, I fucking jump off. Oh, you can. Huh. Postman Pat, Postman Pat. Okay. That's her. I don't know the context of that letter. I generally look if you or if the audience wanted to read that, and then you guys must be the weirdest people on the planet. Those who just don't care, appreciate you guys. Oh my god! What the? That was the quickest thing ever. Honestly, you just don't understand, do you? Open your ears. Silence! I'm telling you, we don't allow postmen here. Be gone, be gone! Don't be ridiculous. I went through great trials and tribulations to go all the way to the Forsaken Forges and return Mo's letter. Silence! Be gone, be gone! Then please, be reasonable. Can't you... Can you at least sign for the letter? Silence! Be gone, be gone! Just acknowledge I was here. Silence, silence, be gone, be gone. Ah, foolish man. Now you make me angry. I cannot even look at you in the face any longer. Oh, I fear I might. I might just go somewhere cool for my feathers. Cool my feathers. Well, what a wretched early postman. I just don't know anything about my Mr. Mo in any forsaken fortress, and yet he always comes here for bringing this letters. Does this Mo think I'll let him lay a hand on my one and only daughter, Maggie? I don't care those letters, they are, they are never reach her on my watch. I hate you so much. You're the reason why everyone's just dread. Oh no, my dear Mo, baby Mo, when do when will you respond to me? <laughs> now we have to go talk to the hell's Mo. Oh, it's you! I'm sorry you had to witness me fly off the handle like that at Maggie's house. I'm most embarrassed. That man just never mind. To tell you the truth, though, I can't. I came to deliver a letter addressed to Maggie from a moblin named Mo, but as you saw, the girl's stubborn father won't permit me to give it to her. What a stubborn, meddling old man, refusing to accept the letters from the postman. Who's heard of such nonsense? I went to great trouble to go all the way to the Forsaken Fortress, and it was the most frightening ordeal, let me tell you. If I didn't deliver, if I didn't deliver the letter, then I am a failure of the delivery chain. But I have other. Da, 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 da. Look, I have no. Okay, I'll be honest with you guys. That footage that um the, of the last episode that was just seven minutes, I, there was no way I could get it back. I'll be honest with you. So I, I apologize, like maybe someday I'll come back to play this game and play hero mode. Maybe I'll live stream it. So it can be like a little apology letter. Is that, could it be a letter from Mo that I saw in my dreams? Let me read it this instant. Uh, this is Mo. I, I like you, Maggie, so much. I want, want to eat you for dinner. Did you hear that? Those words. This means I'm a, 
I mean, it must mean. Can it be? Is this. This girl. Oh my god, this woman. You know, I don't even know what to think about this. Could you imagine just laying falling from the sky and the people were just like, what the hell, where did that boy come from? Then blow it. No, it has to be at nightfall, he said. I'm just going to wake up. Well, apparently it has to be day you hit the switch, which I don't know why it matters. Apparently it does. That was my bloody back that cracked. Oh, so that changes the wind direction. Guys, I'm on the windmill. I'm on the windmill. Whoa. It's so hot right now. Turn the light on. Whoa. How do we turn this light on? What was the flame in it? Said something about flaming out. Flaming out. No. Thank you. Shoot a scooter Apparently, I had to use a fire arrow. Turned it to light up there. Wouldn't it be charged by electricity? Do you not have that in this universe? Oh dear God! Imagine the league's eyes, bro. Treasure? Yes, let's go. Well, anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.